Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be trying out and giving you my first impressions for this wine lip tint. The brand is Chateau La Biot, but despite sounding French, it is a Korean brand. This is the packaging that it comes in. And after watching review and swatches online, I decided that I like the color RD03 Merlot Burgundy the best. And this is the super cute miniature wine bottle. On the packaging there is some text in Korean, but in English it says the long wearing tint dyes the lips with a bold yet delicate color that resembles quality wine while moisturizing the lips. I don't have time for constantly reapplying my lip color with precision, so I've been searching a quality lip tint that is low maintenance and requires a few touch-ups during the day. So I have high hopes for this. The cup is purple, but this is how it looks in the bottle, a deep wine color. But now let me apply it and see how it looks on my lips. I've already prepped them by applying my favorite lip balm overnight. There is absolutely no peeling, chapping or dry patches, which should be a perfect canvas for the lip tint. I've zoomed you in and now let's get down to business. It's a very thin consistency and it applies easily, but one dip is sufficient for only one lip. It is a little bit streaky and it stings a little bit like you've put alcohol on your lips. I'm giving it a few seconds for the first coat to dry a little bit. And now the second coat. This is how it looks like with two coats and for some reason my bottom lip is maybe two tones darker than my upper one. It has a pleasant smell, but it doesn't remind me of wine. The taste is sweet, but a bit chemically sweet, like an artificial sweetener. The initial sensation is a little bit drying on the lips, but it goes away after a few minutes. The color looks like a deep berry or plum color and is a little bit vampy for my complexion. But now I'm taking you with me for the whole day wear test. This is how it looks like. In natural lighting, you can see the difference in color, but I will apply a third coat of lip tint on my upper lip. And this is three to two coats. This is an hour and a soup later. Another half an hour and a pair later and the intensity of the tint has almost faded away, but my lips feel dried out. Let me try to fix that with a bit of lip balm. Okay, now my lips feel and look much better. That's the six hour checkup. I'm calling it a day and I will give it a second chance tomorrow. It is day two of the testing. I've exfoliated my lips with a sugary lip scrub, then applied a coat of the lip tint, waited for about 20 seconds and then I applied a coat of lip balm. Two hours later it is patchy and uneven. My final thoughts about it. It has gorgeous packaging, it is not crazy expensive, the color looks quite different on the packaging, on the bottle cap, inside the bottle and on the lips. It applies easily, has a sweet kind of chemically taste. On my lips it looks significantly better applied on one thick coat with a lip balm over it compared to two thin coats. Again, on my lips, it doesn't have that good of a staying power and I should definitely retouch it after eating. First initial stage of applying it to the stage I have nothing on my lips or almost nothing. There are about five to six hours. I'm impressed by the lip tint and how it lasts. The girls were very impressed by the lip tint and how it lasts. And now let me take it off on camera. I will be using some micellar water. And a close-up. On a scale from 1 to 10, I will give it a 6 maybe because I like the color and I'm willing to give it 
second, no, that, that's more than second and third chances, I'm willing to make it work on my lips. Forgot to tell you that the lip tint is transfer proof. Okay, maybe seven. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful. I would be grateful if you shared your tips and suggestions on how to make this lip tint look better and last longer and for other lip tints that you believe are worth trying. Thank you once again for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it and I will see you in my next video. Till then, stay happy and healthy. Bye!